So I had a baseball player who I represented who was so talented. I mean, ridiculous athlete, sick athlete. And, but he never did what we thought he would do at the big league level. Never had the kind of success, never had the, the length of time in the big leagues, never made the kind of money that he thought he would make at the big league level. Just never did what the world thought and what he thought he would he could do. And, and in part, it was because he was so talented, so athletic, that when he would step up to the plate, he thought because he was so athletic, because he was so talented, he really thought, you know, I can get a hold of anything. I can get a hold of anything. And he lacked discipline at the plate in a huge way. And it cost him an unbelievable career, a life-changing career. You know, at some level, we all have pitches coming at us, don't we? We're all stepping up to the plate in our own lives. We got fastballs, curveballs, sliders, changeups. We got them coming at us. And we have to have the discipline to stick to the plan, to discern what's worth swinging at and what's not worth swinging at. I remember he had been struggling at the plate and the coaches were talking about, look, man, you got to let the first pitch go by. I don't care. I don't care what it is. You've got to settle in at the plate, work your plan, but but they had just sort of wanted him to stop swinging at the first pitch because he would go after it no matter what. He was just so aggressive, so talented, right, that he thought he could find a way to get a hold of it. And so I remember once before a game and the coaches had been talking to him about it. It was, it was a big game. I said, look, dude, for me, we're sitting in the family lounge before before. And I said, look, man, just just for whatever it's worth, please just don't swing at the first pitch tonight. Just in every at bat in your four or five ABs, just don't swing at the first pitch. Sure enough, he swung at every first pitch. I mean, he comes in after the game and he was like, oh my God, Molly, I'm so sorry. I just couldn't help myself. I thought I had it, you know? And 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 it was a moment when I went, man, this guy's lack of discipline isn't going to get in the way of him having the kind of success that he should and could have at the big league level. I would just challenge you to pull back and recognize that it isn't about talent at all. It's about discipline. We got to have the discipline to live into the plan that we've created and recognize that as educated, as, as connected, as, as, as all those things that we all might be in our own lives, you might be in your own life. Take that talent, all those gifts, and marry it with discipline, and the sky's the limit. 